Hello. All right, so this past week I interviewed three teachers, one from elementary school, one from middle school, and one from high school. I asked them 10 questions on how they use technology in their classroom. Um, this link, I posted it below as well. So during my questions, I learned, I learned a few key things that I thought were really great. So, um, one of the teachers I spoke with said that they really don't have a collaboration team. Um, I know a lot of schools will meet with one another and collaborate on some ideas, but she said that they don't do that there. But what they do is they share resources. And one, one resource she learned just this week is something called News ELA. Um, that is um, English Language Arts. In case you didn't know, that's NewsELA.com. So she just learned about that resource this week and is already implementing it into her classroom. Um, another resource I learned about is something called Canvas. This is a resource that um, is a, it's a learning management system that allows students to set up assignments for students to complete online so they can submit their, their homework, their assignments, their quizzes, they can ask questions, and then the peer, the students can, can um, can provide feedback on that. So I thought that was a really cool tool to demonstrate competency and reflect learning. Um, so I also learned what digital tool do your students use to collaborate? Um, another teacher said Google Slides. She said this has been a game changer in her classroom. She teaches special ed and so she said that they got really frustrated that one student would always have to put in all the material. So she says she uses Google along with all the other teachers. They said Google has been a great resource for them um, in their classroom and they use they even use Google Classroom. Um, so anyway, those are a few things. Um, I also have all of my, the answers posted below to the 10 questions that I came up with. Um, I also wanted to analyze a lesson plan. This lesson plan is for a first grader um, and learning all about the recycling program. So this integrated technology is the teacher would input all of the information into an Excel spreadsheet and, um, and then the teacher would take pictures of the recyclable materials. Um, so obviously I thought a great way to kind of boost up the technology in that classroom is to use Google again, what, what? Um, and allow the students to put in all their own information to create that class chart. Um, so the teacher doesn't have to do that and the students are more hands-on. Um, have the students use their parents' cell phone and take their own pictures so the teacher doesn't have to do that. And then there are tons of recycling apps on the iPad, on any phone, that can really be integrated into the classroom. Um, so I also came up with five questions. These are also posted below um, that I wanted to discuss to help guide my own technology-enabled lesson plans. So the first thing is, have I made sure that technology I'm Im implementing into my classrooms help advocate better learning? So that really means, um, is the technology I'm using, is that helping them become maybe a better reader or something like that? Um, two, after collaborating with my team or learning about new resources from a teacher, have I taken the time to fully learn it and implement it into my classroom? And I put a timeline on mine. Um, I put two weeks. Um, I was really impressed with one of the teachers that as soon as she learned about that new resource, it was implemented within that same week. Um, so I think that's key. You know, you don't forget about it. Three, is technology, is the technology I'm implementing allow for collaboration and connection with one another? I really want to make sure that in my classroom, we don't lose sight of that one-on-one -on -one connection, that the technology doesn't really just take over. Um, the fourth one is, am I using technology in my classroom to help students build knowledge about real world problems? So I really want to maybe use Google or another, um, another resource to help, help get the students aware of all the problems going on in the world. And I also want to further implement um, maybe searching within themselves to see what they can contribute to um, making the world a better place. Number five, 
number five is alive. <laughs> Are all my students able to use the technology? So the technology can be used by all students. Really want to make sure that's high up on my list. All of this is posted below in the video. Bye.